Hi guys, um, so today a crazy big package arrived. Um, I'm going to be opening 45 Bratz dolls today. One is just a custom that I ordered. It's a one-of-a-kind first edition Chloe. And the rest, I will show you, are in this box. It is, um, I'm going to be doing custom dolls. So... That'll be fun. I've ordered the supplies for them as well, but those aren't here yet. Um, so I'm just opening up the Chloe. Yeah. So um, she's very pretty. She was on bid. No one else bid on her. She was insanely cheap. And I was like, well, I have a first edition Chloe now. Let me get a custom one. Okay, wow. Wow, this was definitely worth it. So... She's got a repainted face. I think she's got some blush added, but she's got glittery lips. And then she's got this super silky, I think it's just blue added in. It, basically, the person who was doing this called it a save a doll project to save a doll that would have otherwise been trashed because she was in such poor condition. Um, I am incredibly impressed with this doll. This is... A fantastic doll. She's wearing almost the same version of the outfit. You know, Chloe comes with so many pieces. Um, mine is wearing the same shoes, jeans, and top, except mine also has the jean jacket on, my regular first edition. Um, I don't think I opened her on camera, but her hair is just... So I wanted to kind of open her first. I'm glad they all arrived on the same day. This is kind of an example. Um, I'm just going to be having fun. It's probably going to take me a long time. So the lot was 44 dolls. And, um, it was, shipping was, like, $44.15. The dolls themselves were only $30. They are incredibly TLC. Um, I don't know if all of them will even be able to be saved, but I figure, you know, most of them should be able to. And that's less than $2 a doll, even with shipping. If you don't factor in shipping, it's super cheap. Um, the shipping was probably so expensive because I'm in... California and this person is in Minnesota. That's that's MN. Okay. Okay, wow. So um I'm just going to show you guys. It's like an insane okay. So there's boys, babies, kids, moxies, and regular brats. And I don't know who everyone is, so forgive me. So this is a boy he looks to be in very good shape he just has some I don't know if you can see that he's got like green marks on his chest but his hair is good um yes and then okay she okay oh this is a desert jewels doll because she's got the um the thing in her hair and then on her arms so this is one yeah, I'm not going to be rerouting every single one, just most of them. This one I will probably let stay the same. Um, no earrings though, but I may, we'll see. Okay, so this one has a very choppy, bad haircut. I think this is Megan though. Um, just pretty, very pretty. Um, so this is a kid who still has her earrings in. It's Yasmin because of the beauty mark. It's my first time seeing a kid in person. Oh, one of the brat's kids, not like I've never seen a child. But, um, okay, this one definitely needs fixing. So it is a boy with a rather bad haircut. Somebody just chopped his hair up. I guess they wanted him to have a buzz cut all around instead of the undercut. Rest of him's in very good shape. Another, is this the same? They're not the same one. I think these are both Cameron. They're definitely both. And I found a Cameron at the thrift store, so I do have, he's my only boy. Um, here's another one whose hair has just been basically shaved off so we're gonna keep the boys I'm gonna keep track so four boys two girls and a kids with one of a kind of Chloe out of the way okay so this one 
this is not this is some sort of midnight dance or pretty in punk i think i'm not sure um it's megan with i think that might actually not be a haircut i think that might just be her bangs um very cute probably gonna keep that one as well just her typical this one it's chloe i i mean i always am scared to say one is Chloe because, you know, I'm not sure. I'm still learning the characters, but very cute. Uh, if you know any of these dolls, let me know. Here is another boy whose hair has been pretty badly cut. Um, he's a different shade. Uh, if you can see, this is him. The others are all more of a orangish peach tone. Um, okay, this one is, oh, she's pretty. Um, so, she's got a mark on her face and bad haircut. Okay, <laughs> this one, girl, you need work. Okay, I recognize this one. I think it's some type of Dana. I'm not sure. She could... She could get helped. This one may not be beyond repair. I am just looking to customize, but I still feel bad. So here's a Moxie girl. So I have a Moxie girl who does not have the... Who has feet and a really weird body that I don't like that I was going to customize. I don't know what I'm going to do with her still. But this is a Moxie girl. Again, with the hair. Very interesting. Um, she looks like Bellatrix Lestrange, but not in a bad way. Okay, here is a very cute jade. Honestly, I don't know the different jades. Every time I see an older jade, I'm like, ah, first edition jade. I don't think this is a first edition, but she's pretty cute. Okay, moving on. Okay, this girl has, this is Yasmin with braids. So this one may definitely be one worth saving. Um, I'm not sure when she is. I'm, I'm still so new that it's like, but I want to make sure I'm not doing anyone super rare or, you know, Chloe, I think she could be. I ha I found a doll at the thrift store that I thought was Chloe, but it turns out it was Raya. So I'm still figuring them out. Um, let's just say another blonde doll. Her hair is really, really soft, but it flips crazy. Kind of crimped. Okay, another, um, Moxie girl. These are prettier than the one I found at the thrift store. She has a lot of hair. It's very long, very thick, very voluminous. Okay. Why do I recognize these lips? Is this Flower Girls? No, I don't think it is. Chloe, again. And here is a baby. Um, and these have a special term. She's the kind of mermaid. But she doesn't have like the typical tail of a mermaid. She's got her hair styling though. So we'll probably, I mean, I'm definitely going to be keeping her as she is. Um, here is another doll with kind of green in her eyes. Wow, this is going on quicker, but also longer than I thought it would. Okay, so I think that this is some type of midnight dance doll. Um, she's got marks on her leg, but she has like black stockings that are part of her leg. She has like literal garters. And black gloves. Cool, cool. Let me just... Okay, is this... This is the first edition Chloe. I can recognize that. With really messed up lips. I don't know if you guys can see that. But they are just... Messed up. Here is... I think this is the same one as before with the really dark lips. Um, bad haircut. 
I mean, it's cu it's a cute length, but the front, like, I know you guys can't see it. Is this the same? They're not the same. So this might be a Nevra doll. I don't know. I don't have one, but she seems like that kind of vibe to me. I don't even know if that's what she looks like. Um, this is probably so frustrating. Okay, so this guy has a bad haircut, but I'm not sure if it's factory or not. Um, he's an interesting looking guy. He's got sideburns, but the rest of his head is all, it's all rooted. Here is a Yasmin with a terrible haircut. I mean, again, when I'm saying terrible, I'm not saying short is the bad. Like, if it was well done, I'd be like, oh, okay, fashion pack. Like, I'm learning to accept haircuts. And her face is just incredible. So I'm probably just going to reroute that one instead of full repaint. Okay, um, here's another one of her. So far, I have not seen any Sasha's. Um, so... There she is. Let's see if there's anything else super interesting. This one, oh, it's Sasha. I was gonna be like, this doll has a lot of hair. Okay, so it's literally in a total ball. And she's bald on top. Very bad hair, very cute face. And her body's in fantastic shape. That's a comment on the vinyl, not on body type. Okay, so here is a flaming red-haired doll. She's cute. She's got brown eyes with, like, blue and green eyeshadow. Another boy with a rather... It's, it's floppy. When you, his arms are floppy. I don't know. I look crazy. Um... He's good. I think he's... Is he the same? Yep. Yeah, I think he's... Hang on. No, these two have slightly different eyes. They're both brown eyes, so these are definitely the same character. But their eyes are a bit different. So this... This is Dana, I think. Um, with just... This... <laughs> This kind of reminds me of Elsa. I haven't seen Frozen, but you know she's got those, like, really long bangs. So, it's not a look, in my opinion. And, you know, as far as customization goes... Oh! As far as customization goes, we're just going to fix this. This guy has very soft hair. Now, it's it's got a weird cut to it. Um... But the hair is really soft. Okay, and here's a Yasmin with a different sort of haircut. It's actually kind of cute. And, like, I wouldn't be opposed if it was... You know, sometimes people try and do these haircuts and it's like, if that was done well... Or was the factory haircut? I would be here for it. But this is just... I don't know. It's kind of like... Don't meme this doll. I know what you all are thinking. Um, <laughs> and... Another... What I believe to be Chloe in a... Updo. She's actually got a very pretty integrate hair cut, hairstyle. Um, this is another moxie. We're almost done. And yet another moxie. The moxie's hair seems to they seem to have a lot of it. And it's just not what I'm going for right now. I, not the bad, like the I think a lot of big Voluminous hair is really cool, but their hair is fried. Um, this is an interesting doll. I have not seen her makeup is very understated, and 
she's she's very interesting very pretty i've never seen one like that with like that hair color combination this is another first edition chloe this one i do not feel bad about rerouting at all um very pretty though and looks like two more um just another doll she's got very pretty like Honey blonde hair, and okay, this is the last one. It's one more Yasmin. So let's do a final count. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Is that correct? Eight boys, one baby, and See, where's the kid? That sounds so weird. Okay, one kid. So that's a total of ten so far. And then we have... Let's get all the moxies together. One, two, three, and I know I did more than that. So three moxie dolls, four. And is that it? Is there really 30 of the girls? Let's see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26. Okay. Seems like I'm missing four because there was supposed to be 44. Hang on. We're going to get to the bottom of this. 26, 27, 4, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40. You know what? Either it was a miscount or four dolls were left out. I may message the seller. But 40 dolls for $30 to the seller and then about 44 for shipping. With tax, it was like 78 Probably a bit more. I'm not sure. California has high taxes. <sighs> so I definitely have my work cut out for me as far as um, rerouting. So this is a good inspiration. Her hair is so perfect. Um, so if you are interested in seeing some of, well, these many, many dolls being rerouted, repainted, um, any sort of rep repairs, like for those that I'm going to save, um, be sure to, uh, as I say, like, comment, and subscribe. All you have to do is subscribe if you want to see that or, but, you know, it's, it's just something where if you like the video, why not like, why not subscribe, why not comment? Um, I'm still getting the hang of this. I'm just kind of having fun and yeah, so let me know what you think. If you recognized any of the dolls, like, this Sasha is so bald, but I can tell her face that she's a different sort of doll. Like, literally, this is one continuous lump. It's just bad. Um, and combing it out, she'd be even balder than she was, so I'm just going to remove the hair. Um, but let me know. Hang on, that is a... One of those tags. I know I've said it before in my other videos. I hate the little plastic hangs things. Um, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. And um, I know it was probably pretty silly of me not knowing who anyone is. Except for the one Desert Jewels, Chloe. Um, but if you know, you know who anyone is, you want to point it out go ahead and comment. I would, I would love that feedback. All right. Talk to you guys in the next video. Bye.